Hello folks, this is Scienceopedia. If you are visiting this channel for the first time, this is the place where you can find interesting answers to your scientific questions. Let us jump into today's video. All of us know genetic material of human beings is DNA. DNA is present in chromosomes. As a human, we possess 46 chromosomes. Generally, chromosome is of two types, one is autosome and another is allosomes. Autosomes is nothing but body chromosomes, whereas allosomes are sex chromosomes. Therefore, 46 chromosomes of human beings contain 44 body chromosomes and two sex chromosomes. Six chromosomes in male are X and Y and in female are X and X. Human being produces gametes which contains only one half of the whole chromosomes. That is 22 autosome plus one allosome. Male gamete is sperm and female gamete is egg. Sperm has 22 autosomes and one allosome either X or Y but never both. Which means the possible chromosomal combinations of sperm are 22X or 22Y. Egg has 22 autosomes and one allosome which is nothing but X. During intercourse, sperm and egg meet together. This process of meeting is called fertilization. Sperm fuses with the egg and forms zygote. Zygote is the single celled baby. Egg has 22 eggs. If it is fused by a sperm of 22 eggs, then the result is 44 eggs eggs. So the gender of the baby is female. If it is fused with 22 y sperm, then the result is 44 x y. Hence the gender of the baby is male. Within 24 hours after fertilization, Zygote rapidly divides into many cells. One divide into two, two divide into four, four divide into eight, and eight divide into sixteen, and furthermore. Pregnancy period of human being is about forty weeks, which is roughly about two seventy plus or minus seven days. This time is divided into three stages called trimester. Each trimester is a set of about 3 months. Month 1 Watertight amniotic sac is formed. It helps in cushioning the growing baby. Placenta also form which is nothing but the round flat organ that transfers nutrients from mother to baby and transfer waste from baby. By the end of the first month, the baby is about 0.7 cm long. Month 2. Facial features continues to develop. Each ear begins as a little fold of skin at the side of the head. Tiny buds that eventually grows into arms and legs. Fingers, toes and eyes are also formed. The neural tube is well developed now. By the end of the second month, baby is about 1 inch long and weighs about 1 gram. Month 3. Arms, hands, fingers, feet and toes are fully formed. Beginning of teeth is formed. Reproductive organs also develop and gender is still difficult to distinguish on ultrasound. All organs and limbs are functioned. By the end of the third month, baby is about 4 inches long. Second trimester is the middle section of pregnancy. Eyelids, eyelashes, eyebrows nails and body hairs are formed. Teeth and bones are denser now. Nervous system starts to function. Gender can be easily distinguished under ultrasound. By the end of the fourth month, baby is 6 inches long and weighs about 4 ounces. Month 5 
hair on head begin to grow we can feel baby's movement first movement is called quickening and can be felt like a flutter by the end of the month 5 baby is 10 inches long month 6 the eyelids begin to part and the eyes open baby respond to sound by moving or by increasing its pulse by the end of the month 6 baby is 12 inches long and weighs about 2 pounds month 7 body develops reserve fat hearing is fully developed amniotic fluid begins to diminish by the end of the month 7 baby is 14 inch long and weighs about 2 to 4 pounds month 8 baby starts to kick more except lungs all the internal systems are fully developed by the end of the month 8 baby is 18 inches long and weighs about 5 pounds month 9 lungs are close to being fully developed baby has coordinated reflexes by the end of the month 9 baby is 17 to 19 inches long and weighs about 5.5 to 6.5 pounds month 10 this is the final month of the pregnancy mother can go into labor at any time movement is less because the space is tight by the end of the 10th month baby is about 18 to 20 inches long and weighs about 7 pounds in india we have so many orphaned children who would probably not survive till their maturity unless they are taken care of our laws also permit legal adoption and it is as it one of the best methods for couple looking for parenthood That's all for today's video. Hope you have some valuable takeaway from this video. Do like and comment if you like our content. Share this video to your kin and kith to whom you find this video helpful. For more contents like this, subscribe Sciencepedia and tap the bell icon. Catch you later in the next video.